Hello everyone, it is Samurai Blacksmurf here, and how are you fine looking sexy ass juicy legs? Beautiful lips! I don't even know where I'm going with this, but how are you guys doing today? You guys are looking pretty good. Yeah, pretty good, alright? I mean, I tap that ass, I'll tell you right now. Oh, I've definitely hit that from the front and the back. Yeah, anyways, this is gonna be slightly awkward because I know most of you guys are actually little 12 year old boys. I do dig that though. Anyways, can I get my swarm? Can I get my swarm? Mm, sometimes, bros, I just don't understand this game, man. Like, seriously? <laughs> no, seriously though. Sometimes, like, you know, in those situations, I'm always like, seriously? Like, are you super serious right now? Like, was I really supposed to die? I mean, is that fair though? Do you really? Treyarch? Is Treyarch trolling me? I'm not sure. But anyways, moving on from that, guys. Today, we're playing on the map Turbine, so ground war kill confirmed. Surprisingly, even though I do pretty well in this game, I actually get two swarms. I could have got three, but you saw how I died. But anyways, moving on. <laughs> Whatever happened, happened, you know, just... We're now in the present. The past is the past. And the present is... Isn't the present actually the future? Anyways, that's a whole other topic for a whole other video. Today, uh, yeah, like I said, I, even though I do surprisingly good on this game, in this game... Right now, I don't actually like this map at all. The only reason I do like it is because the swarms go so hard, man. They go so hard in the motherfucking paint, bro. Like, seriously. No, I'm not joking, though. Swarms on this map, they go, they, they get you a ton of kills. And that's the only reason why I like playing on this map. And then why I don't like playing on this map, I can go on and on and on and on about, you know, why I don't like it. But it's mainly because of the snipers. There's just so many snipers in this map. And it's, it's really annoying when you spawn, when you die and you spawn all the way at the back. And then you have to go all the way to the front. And then by the time you get there, you probably get sniped again. And then it's just like a cycle. You know, you die and then you spawn all the way at the back. And then you go to the middle and try to find an enemy. Then oopsie daisy, you're dead. And right now, I'm on top of this plane. I really shouldn't be doing that. Guys, dude, don't even think about going on top of that thing because it's really easy to get sniped. But luckily, these guys weren't that good. They were noobs. But anyways, guys, today I want to tell you how to do well in Black Ops 2. How to do consistently well because as you guys know already, I've been complaining about this game. Well, I was complaining about this game quite a lot. But now I am over and done with that stuff and I've actually learnt the secret behind Black Ops 2 and how to do well in it. And it is, I think personally, there's there's a lot of stuff I wanted to cover, but I think one of the main things for me is Prestige and actually affected me a lot. That's what I feel personally, I'm not really sure, but I felt that Prestige just gave me a disadvantage. Not with the, you know, I told you before that Prestige doesn't affect your classes because, uh, or camos or anything like that. But I do feel like I didn't have, even though you get to unlock, you get a prestige token to unlock a perk or a score streak or a, you know, a, an assault rifle or SMG, whatever you want to unlock it with. I still felt like I didn't have all the options that I wanted and um, I don't know, I just felt that prestige just made it harder for me to do well in. Especially because I like using those big score streaks and having the swarm dogs and all of that. Maybe I should maybe I should use my prestige tokens on the score streaks and maybe I would have, you know, done slightly better. I don't know. But, um... Yeah, uh, Precision, I think, I wouldn't recommend Precision if you like using those big score streaks, alright? I definitely wouldn't recommend Precision if you like using those big score streaks. Also, speaking of Precision, I actually wanted to ask you guys in this video whether or not you wanted me to do a video, uh, of, uh, you know, of me Precision live. Because right now I'm Prestige 4, 55, uh, level 55, and I do actually have the option to Prestige. Uh, excuse me, that's my phone right there. No, uh, just moving on. Uh, yeah, I do actually have the option to proceed right now. And I was thinking of doing it live just to show you guys what you get and, you know, uh, like how it works exactly. And uh, just tell me if you want that yes or no. And I'll yeah, just leave it in the comments saying, like, just another way, you know, just say yes if you want that and no if you don't really want that. And, um, yeah, now another thing I've doing really well in this game is, uh, you can't play with that attacking uh, mindset. You can't rush as much as you want to and trust me you know this is coming from a you know me i used to rush a lot in mw3 and i was so used to that fast paced game but um in black ops 2 you can't do that anymore guys i'm really telling you, you have to play defensive you have to play smart and i trust me i know even though it might not seem that fun to play at defensive it, it really re rewards you because once you get that first set of score streaks it just helps you get onto the next one and the next one and the next one and um, yeah, so that's definitely one of the main things about this game is don't rush, just play defensive 
And out of nowhere, you actually find yourself, oh shit, I'm on my black road right now, and then I've got my load star, and then, oh, here's a swarm. And then those will actually help you get onto your next score treats and so on. And you, I promise you won't go negative. You won't go ne negative at all. And if you follow these techniques, you do well in every single game you play. Just play defensive, play smart, don't rush as much. And um, because you can't rush in this game, unfortunately, I'm telling you guys, it's just they've really made it. That's why you see a lot of campers, and especially with the head glitching and the campers in the window. Not just the snipers, but and just in general. This game, I'm not sure if you've noticed, but you do actually run into a lot of campers, and they don't really like to rush as much. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to rate and comment. Uh, I, I know I'm starting to upload these, so I was actually thinking if we could start doing those 1,000 likes again. So if we could hit 1,000 likes on this video, I know the, the new YouTube layout sucks, but hopefully we can, you know, just speed that in the ass. And yeah, bros, so thank you for watching. Please don't forget to rate and comment and subscribe if you're not around here. And I'll see you, bros, later. Bye.